Fifteen Aam Aadmi Party MLAs met the Lieutenant Governor of Delhi, Najib Jung, on a host of issues, including the tanker scam. The Aam Aadmi Party government had filed three FIRs against former Chief Minister Sheila Dixit and one against Ambani in the KG Basin case. A dozen Aam Aadmi Party MLAs at Delhi Lieutenant Governor's doorstep, bizarrely demanding that he file a police complaint against himself. This relates to four cases of alleged scams committed during the tenure of former CM Sheila Dixit. Aam Aadmi Party alleges the LG shielded Sheila Dixit. And I had sent clearly an SMS yesterday night asking for time. I was neither responded with a no or with a yes. So we came, we came to meet him. We wanted to hand, uh, hand over a complaint to him, which he possibly didn't want to face us. The Anti-Corruption Bureau investigating a tanker scam on Mr. Jung's recommendation filed a case against KGR listing corruption, misuse of power and criminal conspiracy. NDTV has accessed the report of a probe ordered by the AAP government last year. It says the Sheila Dixit government awarded tenders for 385 stainless steel tankers at a huge loss and in violation of rules. The tender value of approximate 41 crore in 2010 was escalated to nearly 637 crore by 2012. This led to contract being arbitrarily awarded to a company called National Institute of Smart Governance or NISG. The minutes of the meeting annexed in the inquiry report say this was suggested and signed by then CM and head of Jal Board, Sheila Dixit. Soon after, BJP filed another complaint accusing Kejriwal of sitting on the report for nearly a year. इस दिन उन्होंने 28 अगस्त 2015 को रिपोर्ट दबाई और 11 महीने तक इस भ्रष्टाचार पर कोई रोक नहीं लगाई इसका मतलब साफ है इस दौरान लगभग 50 करोड़ रुपया सरकारी खजाने से लीक हुआ उनकी जानकारी के सामने दिल्ली के सरकार के खजाने से अतिरिक्त 50 करोड़ रुपया इस दौरान लीकेज हो गया भ्रष्टाचार में जो उनकी जानकारी में था the ACB chief investigating the scam is likely to question both Sheila Dixit and Kejriwal, prompting an attack by Aam Aadmi Party. If somebody indulges and interferes in the investigation, there is proper procedure for taking action against them also. It is a defamatory against a particular agency and we condemn such kind of, uh, uh, such kind of allegations against a particular agency. With an all-out political blame game over the issue, this is not the last we have heard of this story just yet. With Sonal Mehrotra in New Delhi, Josh Chavla, NDTV.